Hi guys! Today I'm going to unbox a Fujifilm Classic Neo 90. It's um, it's the camera that I really want for a long, long time. And I watch a, a lot of reviews in YouTube about that. Actually, before before deciding to buy that Neo Classic 90, what I'm really planning to buy is the Fujifilm Square SQ6. Because when I saw it, it's so huge and it's not that typical because it has a square photo when you use it and the colors are also nice it has pink white and black that's why that's what I'm planning to buy at first but then since I watched reviews of that camera and then I also watch other reviews of other Instax camera or Fujifilm camera and then I noticed that the best camera that I can buy is the Fujifilm Classic Neo 90. It is the same price with that SQ6 which is 7,999 pesos and at first I think oh it's square it's, it's 799 and then Neo Classic is, so, is also 799 and it's the SQ6 is newer why they have the same price. Another thing is Fujifilm release a Taylor Swift square camera. I'm a big fan of Taylor Swift and I want to buy that limited edition one. But then when I went to mall to see how much is the price of that Fujifilm, it's 11499 If I'm not mistaken, it's so expensive. So I decided that, yeah, I'm going to buy the Neo Classic 90. Because... I think it's it has a lot of features than the square six and at first I want the square photo but then I realized that I can put it on my cell phone or in the back of my phone and it's not and I cannot put it in my wallet so I decided to buy the, the classic Mio 90 so this is it so I went to Mall of Asia and bought this one so I bought it for 799 pesos so this is what it looks like i chose the black one because i think the brown one is very common and i don't like the brown one because i think it will match my phone because it's black my phone is black and it's black and it will be much matchy so i already opened it in the store to check if it's working so it's not really 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 unboxing but i just want to show you what's inside of this camera so you will know if you want to you want to buy this kind of camera also so let's open it so yeah put the receipt inside and i have this warranty this manual manual so I'm going to read it because I like reading manuals I don't I just don't want not knowing what to do with the camera that's why I read the manual because you know I'm I don't want to figure it out when I'm using it so I read the manuals I'm yeah I'm a bit nerd and this papers another manuals I think I think and then the camera stop it's in black also it has a Fujifilm logo and then when we remove this thingy here's the battery 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 I think you can use other battery, other other brands of battery if you want a spare battery for your camera. So yeah, it would be easy to find a replacement. So the the plug, uh, the charger, the charger. looks 
looks like. You're going to insert this one on this on this one. thingy that you're going to put also on the camera along with the next drop and of course the camera it's the camera camera so this is what it looks like it's black I like black because I think it's classic and yeah i just love the retro style of this camera and i really haven't tried this one so i'm going to try it right now so let's just put it aside and oh i also bought a film it's the rainbow one I think they said it's the it's the best selling one. Um, maybe because it's rainbow. But it cost me four hundred pesos. Mm, it's so expensive. So I'm going to try to use this in stocks. So this is my first time to really use this camera because I haven't tried it at the store. And of course I this is also my first time to put a film inside this camera. So as you can see at the back the battery compartment and the film compartment are on the same side so the the salesman the salesman told me that i should be careful when i'm opening this one the battery compartment and the film compartment because i might open the film compartment and of course if it has a film inside it will it would be a waste so now i'm going to put the battery first i haven't charged this camera yet so I don't know so I'm really excited because it's my very first Instax camera and I think I will keep it forever so you just put the battery just like that and then of course yeah and then I just close it let's open this oh that's what it looks like inside Ooh. so based on the review that i read it has a lot of features it has also a tripod mount which is very nice because you know what i'm also contemplating if i'll buy the instax mini 8 because it's cheaper and it has a bundle promo right now which has a 30 30 films inside it's only five thousand pesos or four thousand eight hundred ninety nine pesos so okay i must buy that one maybe because maybe because i um it's possible that i won't use this frequently because you know the films are very expensive but then i think about it if i'm going to buy a camera i'll choose a camera that has lots of features and looks classic than the other one so because the instax mini 8 looks like a toy really uh, but it's nice because it's cheaper it has lots of colors to choose from and yeah it's cute but it looks like a toy <laughs> so i chose the new classic and the black one so oh this is how it looks like when you open it so i'm just going to tear this one yeah so this is how it looks like it has a yellow line there yellow line and then let's see i'm going to put the camera on this one like that and then I'm going to close it. Oh, 
wait does the battery don't have a charge so i'm going to charge it first just wait by the way um this camera should be charged for two hours and after that it's ready to use of course <laughs> I'm going to charge it first because it has no charge I don't know why I didn't charge it because I think it's fully charged yeah I'm answering myself so so I'm just going to insert it like this I'm just copying what the salesman did the store so yeah and get that just to show you and then I'm going to charge it the outlet is already beside me that it turns red <laughs> the battery now is fully charged but I already moved the manual and it says that I should put the battery first before the film and I already inserted the film a while ago right so what I'm doing now is I'm going to remove the the film I'm going to put it in the box first because I'm afraid it might be exposed so sorry so no I'm not going I'm not going to put it inside the box so I'll just put it here, the battery quickly. And insert it once again. And I hope I didn't damage the film. So it was removed automatically. Yeah, it was removed automatically. I don't need to click the shutter. So I'm just to go to open that like that. Just close it once again. So I'm just going to open it like that. And these are the manuals. So there's a flower thingy there. The light and dark. And the timer, the flash. And the mode so it's the macro <laughs> i forget to what it's called like so i have 10 films so this is my very first time to shoot using this and i hope i won't butcher it or i won't mess it because it's so expensive right i watch other vlogs about instax camera and it shows that or they they told that need to follow the manual so if you're inside you need to choose inside so i'm just going to pick the mode and wait so there is some party inside kids landscape okay i don't know what's that I don't know where's the, the inside or the I read it back. I forgot it quickly. So this is the one. There's a lot of manuals here, different manuals and stuff. But there's no manual on how did I choose? inside but maybe but maybe the very first one is inside so i'm just going to choose it this is my life here i'm just going to twist this side and open the camera so i guess it's less than two hours since i charged the battery so i'm gonna no i'm not going to use the selfie the timer because so i'm choosing this one i hope i'm choosing the right one and since it has a selfie mirror here, 
I'm going to use this. So let's take it. Turn. Okay. Wish me luck. Oh, it's developing. And it's indigo. I thought it's going to be red. But it's not. So let's wait for it. Is it going to develop within 90 seconds? So, oh my god. <laughs> I look ugly. Oh my gosh. Double chin. Look at that, look at that. <laughs> uh, it's developing, it's developing. So, it finally developed. And that's what it looks like. So this is my unboxing and my mini review of this camera, which is Fujifilm Instax Neo Classic 90 and it's in polar black and if you want me to do more reviews or videos about this one just comment down below don't forget to like and subscribe bye